Welcome back to All Celebs, your go-to source for the latest celebrity disputes and intrigues. Today, we are delving into the gripping story of Kendrick Lamar against Drake, a dispute that shook the hip-hop world. Buckle up as we go through the complex web of competition, ego, and quality that constituted this iconic fight. Kendrick Lamar's Incredible Rise Kendrick Lamar's rise to superstardom began in the rough streets of Compton, California, and has been nothing short of incredible. Lamar's rise in the rap world was rapid thanks to his unrivaled ability to relate stories and provide social criticism. From his modest beginnings making mixtapes to his groundbreaking albums that questioned the status quo, Lamar's influence on the genre cannot be underestimated. Early Beginnings and Influences Before becoming the voice of a generation, Kendrick Lamar grew up in Compton's tough streets. He found solace in music inspired by his experiences and hip-hop legends like Tupac and Dr. Dre. His unique style set him apart. His 2012 debut album, Good Kid, M.A. Aid City, was a critical and commercial success, with hits like Swimming Pools and Bitch, Don't Kill My Vibe launching him to fame and cementing his position as a hip-hop powerhouse. Drake's Mikuric Rise In Toronto, Canada, Aubrey Drake Graham was building his path to stardom. Drake's rise from beloved TV actor to global music sensation was swift and explosive. With a catalog full of catchy hooks and infectious personality, he cemented his place as a rising legend. From actor to artist, Drake traded his role as Jimmy Brooks on Degrassi for a mick, courageously pursuing hip-hop. His exceptional talent and captivating live performances quickly won over industry insiders and fans, propelling him to stardom. Chart-topping success Drake's debut album, Thank Me Later, 2010 received critical acclaim, launching a streak of successes that dominated the airwaves. With each album from Take Care to Views, Drake solidified his position as a generation's most important musician breaking records and defying expectations. Meanwhile, Kendrick Lamar's rise to stardom set the stage for a clash of titans. In 2013, Kendrick's verse on Control ignited the feud, assertively claiming supremacy and calling out Drake and others. The hip-hop landscape was forever changed. The Control verse, a statement of dominance. Kendrick Lamar shocked the hip-hop industry to its core with his blazing verse on Big Scene's Control. With lyrics like, I'm Machiavelli's offspring, I'm the king of New York, Lamar boldly asserted himself as the unquestioned rap game's monarch, daring his peers to improve their lyrical skills or risk falling behind. The verse sent shockwaves across the industry, igniting debates and conversations among both fans and critics. Drake's response, a subtle rebuttal. While many artists were eager to reply to Kendrick's challenge, Drake adopted a more measured approach, preferring to confront the subject on his own time and terms. Drake made it apparent in his songs and interviews that he was not backing down from the race, using a series of subtle disses. The back and forth between the two musicians shook the hip-hop scene, with fans anticipating each new diss tune and retort. Shots fired, musical retaliation. Drake and Kendrick Lomar's feud escalated with each releasing subtle disses in their music and interviews. Fans dissected every line, fueling the rivalry. Kendrick's album Damn, 2017 intensified the beef with tracks like Element and Huan Beale containing perceived jabs at Drake. The hip-hop world was abuzz, analyzing every lyric for hidden meanings and connections to the ongoing battle between the two titans. Social Media Warfare The feud between Kendrick Lamar and Drake spilled onto social media, where subtly gave way to brazen callouts and cryptic remarks. Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat became the new arenas, with fans eagerly awaiting the next move in this high-stakes game of one-upmanship. Cryptic tweets and subtle shade fueled the controversy with followers deciphering every word for hidden meanings and subliminal messages. The digital stage became a real-time battleground captivating audiences and fueling speculation about the true nature of their relationship. Collabs and Cold Shoulders The dichotomy of relations Kendrick Lamar and Drake's complicated relationship saw them collaborating on tracks like Poetic Justice, showcasing their musical synergy. However, their feud persisted, with tense encounters at award shows and industry events revealing the lingering animosity. This paradox of collaboration and conflict added fuel to the fire, leaving fans wondering if their differences would ever be resolved. The Enduring Legacy of Beef Years have passed since the first salvos were launched, but the Kendrick Lamar Drake feud lives on inscribed in hip-hop history. As both artists continue to create the cultural landscape via their music and impact, the dispute exemplifies the competitive energy that fuels creative expression and innovation in the business. Lesson learned and unresolved tensions As the dust settles on Kendrick Lamar and Drake's fight, one cannot help but think about the lessons learned and the unsolved issues that still exist on the surface. 
While both musicians have achieved unprecedented success in their careers, the rivalry still looms large, serving as a continual reminder of the music industry's intricacies and paradoxes. Conclusion, reflection on the journey. And there you have it, the epic story of Kendrick Lamar and Drake's infamous fight. From modest beginnings to worldwide dominance, their rivalry has enthralled viewers and prompted unending discussion among followers. What do you think motivated their animosity? Please share your ideas in the comments below. In addition, if you want to see more exclusive celebrity material, remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, take care.